Jason is joining us here, the CEO of Sensign Health here on Proactive London after revealing an exclusive license and development agreement with Excalibur Healthcare Services. So you're going to go through all of the detail for us. A warm welcome to Proactive and a very good afternoon to you, Paul. So maybe talk us through the significance of the deal announced today. This is a real breakthrough deal for Sensign. It's the first time we have secured a recurring revenue royalty on the sales of someone else's products in exchange for providing the artificial intelligence inside that makes their products perform better. Now, in this case, the products that Excalibur have developed to market are lateral flow diagnostic tests. You know, the tests we've become you know, very uh, used to um, during the COVID pandemic. Yeah. And that's going to be the main focus of the short-term application for use with COVID testing. But in the future, for the so-called hidden pandemic too of diagnostic tests for cancer. So we're really excited about this. It's uh, an exclusive licensing deal, as, as you've said, Katie, for our Magnify technology. And the lateral flow diagnostic market, even before COVID, was a very large and, and fast growing market. It was worth something like six billion US dollars before the pandemic even started. And now it is significant larger because of the much greater use of, of lateral flow testing that, that COVID has, has driven. I think the other thing that's really important for Sensine is that this is the first time we have secured a minimum royalty in an agreement licensing our AI tech, mm -hmm. 4.8 million pounds over the first two years of the agreement. The agreement has the potential to generate revenue significantly more than that. Basically, every time a test is used that is read by our AI software, we get paid a, a, a royalty each time that test is, is recorded. Right. So what are the advantages of lateral flow tests compared with other COVID tests? Well, they're much cheaper, first of all. They're, 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 uh, it's the same, same technology that is used in pregnancy testing. And the fact that they are cheaper, both in terms of the actual cost of the test and the fact that, that they can be used without having to visit a lab or going to a testing center, so they can be done at home or in the workplace. So that means that they can be used much more widely. They provide results quickly, typically in about 15 minutes. And the fact that they are inexpensive and can be used in the workplace means that you can use them for frequent testing of people, even without symptoms, so that you can help monitor people to ensure that they have not um, developed COVID and are able, therefore, to continue working and things like that. Right. So cheaper, quicker. How does your technology improve the lateral flow test, though? Well, the, the, the advantage of using our technology is that it turns your smartphone into a highly accurate reader of the test. Mm -hmm. To get the result, you look at the test and you see whether a line comes up on the test. We use the camera within the phone and the analysis of the image using a deep learning artificial intelligence program to improve the accuracy of the test. What we're able to do is to see beyond the human visible spectrum. So if you have a very low virus load, you have a very faint line and often it's not picked up because you can't see it, but the line is there. And so what we're able to do is to improve the sensitivity of the test using our technology. That provides the benefit of reducing the possibility of a false negative result, which is, which is clearly really important. Mm, vital. Um, in terms of this collaboration, why is Excalibur the right partner for Sensine? Well, you know that um, often when we've, we've talked to you at Proactive, we talk about the sort of world-class science that Sensine has around deep machine learning and AI. Excalibur has world-class science in the chemistry of lateral flow tests. Their lab at Cambridge has developed a test which through developments in the chemistry of the test is more accurate than other lateral flow tests. So in, in some ways it's, it's a Cambridge science working with, with Oxford science to create something which is really, really world-class here. Mm 
they um, have approval for their test from the, the regulator, the MHRA. That approval covers both symptomatic and asymptomatic patients. So as I was saying earlier, and their test is being marketed today in the United Kingdom and in Europe. Very importantly, they have the manufacturing capacity to manufacture 3 million tests a day and therefore very significant potential to make a real impact here. We've talked a lot about the, the possibility of, of really helping in the, in the fight against COVID and that's our short term focus. But the Excalibur team in Cambridge are working on the development of new lateral flow tests for the diagnosis of certain cancers. That's kind of in some ways the hidden pandemic, you know, um, something like um, a thousand people a day are told that they've developed cancer. The ability to screen for cancer earlier is going to be a huge change that's taking place within healthcare. So it's going to be great to be able to apply the Sensine AI technology to that fast developing area. And we can expect those first cancer diagnostic tests to be coming to market next year. Is there potential for use of the, the lateral flow test in other diagnostic tests? As we've got used to, if you like, using lateral flow tests for COVID, we've, we're therefore more able to consider the use of lateral flow tests for other types of, of conditions. And importantly, that testing being done away from the hospital or having to go to a clinic. So that's going to be an important driver of what we see to be a real change in the way medicine is practiced with much more screening. Um, you know, we're used to when we're not feeling very well, just sort of shrugging, you know, putting up with it. I think in future you're gonna be more used to actually taking a test just to find out what's, what's wrong with us. So that's a big driver of increased use of lateral flow tests. But the Magnify technology that Sensign has developed is not just useful for lateral flow tests. It's a generic tool that uses a deep learning neural network to be able to analyze medical images of all different types. It was originally developed for some of the work that we've been doing to analyze scans uh, of, of, of patients. Um, and so we see real potential for Magnify beyond this particular agreement in using it in other types of diagnostic tests with other types of medical devices where you're wanting to use the power of AI to give an improved interpretation of the image to be able to use that, that machine intelligence to improve the accuracy of diagnosis. Fascinating as always. Thank you very much indeed. Lord Paul Drayson, the CEO of Sensine Health. Thank you.